Welcome or welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'll be making three different vases and I'm starting off with these two mirrors and this candle holder by gluing them together. Next, I'm using these blue glass gems and I'm going to glue them around the perimeter of both of my mirrors. I wasn't able to fully cover the bottom with all my gems, but that's okay. This will be positioned to the back. Now I'm going to take this vase and glue it to the center of my top mirror. I'm gluing these mirror tiles down to give my vase a unique look. Y'all already know, once I was done with this step, I removed any excess glue strings, cleaned my mirrors off, and then I had something that looked like this. Y'all, how cute is this? This can be used as a vase, a candle holder, a centerpiece, or whatever your heart desires. I added blue and clear gems to the center, and I also added a push light. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. For project number two, I'll be using this square mirror, this candle holder, and also another vase. For this project, I'm gluing the mirror tiles on top of my mirror. Now I'm gluing three gems on each side.
This is how this one turned out. Look how glam this is. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. For project number three, I'm going to cover this entire vase with these blue gems. I left this open space right here because when I first started gluing my gems down, they wasn't fitting going all the way around. So I decided to wait until I was done to fill them in. I'm using another square mirror and a candle holder for this last project as well. I'm gluing my mirror tiles on top of my mirror just as I did for project number two, but for this one, it's gonna be a little different. Once I was done with this step, I then had something that looked like this. I love how all three projects turned out, but this one might be my favorite. Comment down below which project you guys like best and don't forget to like, comment, and share. And if you're curious to see what else I can create, hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you don't miss my next video.